simple machine. Simple machine? Yeah, well, you know that simple machines are things that help you work easier, right? Yeah. Well, these are simple machines. You can take one or more pieces, you know. And want to watch? Sure. Simple Machines, Robert Melkovich, is brought to you in part by Mrs. Blaisdell, Sarah Cashman, Bobby Richter, and Peter Beer. Coleman Fuel for gasoline capping appliances. Bells, bells, bells. Ooh. Robert Milkovich, your help is much needed in this assignment. Your mission, to find six types of simple machines. Helping you will be your co-super spy, Mr. Brown. Once again, you'll be competing with Boris Korsakoff. Work fast. Quick, run, now, go. Keep going, now. <laughs> A screw, an inclined plane wrapped around a wedge. When force is put down on the screw, resistance push it pushes up. Are we going to get it? There's a laser surrounding it. Well, I have just the thing. A magnet. Here are the screws. Hold on to them. Job well done. And now for the wedge. wedge, which is usually used to split things apart, um, is used when you put the effort force on the top of the wedge, which splits with the resistance force on either side. A wheel and axle works when you apply an effort force to the wheel. Then resistance comes off of the axle.
Uh oh. Uh oh. We have three of the machines. The screws, wedge, wheel and axle. We need three more. Three more. We need the incline plane. What's that? Who's that? That is Forrest Korsakoff's girlfriend, Natasha Trenchkoff. Why were you spying on us? Bo Boris made me do it. I didn't want to. He, he makes me do everything. It's like I'm a slave. Get to the point. I hate Boris. I hate him so much. I want to help you. Help us with what? I know where the, I know where the incline plane and the pulley are. Where? Let's go back to the table and talk about this then. What, what, what's, what's this now? Comforting the enemy? En enemy? It's fine. She's gonna help us. You're trusting her? Boris's girlfriend? His like Boris. own personal... I know it's where It's fine. The she knows where stuff is. I know. Where the eat lies lay. Mm -hmm. And the pony. <laughs> Gee, Malkovich, I guess I was wrong about Natasha. Without her, we never would have found the machines. We're just missing one more. We're just missing the lever. Well, maybe she knows where that one is, too. I better call her. Natasha, do you know where the lever is? Yes, but I fear that if I tell you, our lives are already in great danger. I have to know. I can't. Oh, Boris will... Boris will what? Is it Malkovich? Go on! Tell him where it is! Tell him where the lever is! The lever is... is on floor, Steve, and the... Thank you. But... Ah, ha, ha! He fell for it! He'll go to the warehouse, and I'll kill him! And Mr. Brown, too! Dozen men. We're finally here. Careful. Looks pretty complicated. Think you can do it, Mr. Brown? Sure. Here. Give me some time. Everybody I want to kill. Give me the lever or Natasha goes. No! Ah. Oh, Mr. Brown! Uh, Robert Milkovich. Go on without me. Take the lever. If Natasha. You'll be okay. Come on. You can do it. Go. No. no. Save the world. <laughs> Malkovich, save me!
Well, that was pretty interesting. Yeah. Since, since we got them all, too. The inclined plane, which makes it easier to raise heavy objects up a level. We also got a pulley, which makes, which makes it easier to raise objects by pulling down and creating an effort force on this side. And it will lift the object over here. And our last... And a lever. This is a fulcrum, and you put the effort force over there, and there's resistance force, and it raises that object. Miss Blaisdell rules. The end. We hope you enjoyed our feature presentation. Stay tuned for As the World Burns. I found it hard to believe someone like you can.